so yeah, they they sent me this. I played it for a couple minutes, and uh, I know there was some controversy about it, and I read up on it, and I I don't know what the hell to think. I'll tell you this though. Eh. Mm. Wait for. It's okay. Just I, I I don't know. Maybe it's not for me. I'd say wait for War Groove. Wait for War Groove. But don't let me, you know, don't let me make your decisions for you. Check it out yourself. Someone mentioned caffeine in relation to my headaches. I know that caffeine helps, and I only drink a cup of coffee a day early, and that's it. So I think it's okay. I, you know, listen, if it's if it's the onset of terminal, that's all right. <clears throat> Mel Gibson was talking about it on the Joe Rogan show where he just got like uh, stem cells injected directly into his vein and his 90 like two year old father um, also had something done in Panama where they just like ate stem cells for a couple days and apparently they're fine now so I'll just head to Panama and I'll just get like a fucking like hose hooked up to a hole in my head and I'll just have the stem cells just rub on my brain it'll be fine it'll be fine Honor to you, my fame. Oh, hey, Lydia. Um, how's the house? Looks good. Looks good. Do we have any bear asses hanging around? Uh, well, hang on a minute. Not like naked butts. I mean, no, oh, whatever. Anyway, I haven't played this since I last streamed it. It's been a busy week for me. So I guess we're just gonna go on some general adventure. -y. And see what happens. Uh, that said, I'm probably going to since my smithing level is is a little a little far off. Maybe I'll do some smithing now. Vinny, you should play it on the PC. The mods are going to make it amazing. I don't really care about the game enough to play it again on the PC with mods. It's fine. Listen. I like this because it's portable. Uh, it's a chance to see the stuff that I didn't see six years ago when I first played it. I like it because I get to stream it and we get to see birds take like seven arrows to the beak. Um, I like it because we get to see giants launch Serana into the fucking stratosphere. Serana has the best comedic timing of any video game character ever. She's the key to all this. So. Uh, I enjoy just vanilla Skyrim on the Switch because it is a big glitchy mess with a number of fun, entertaining moments in between. Uh, if I played it on the PC, or if I got it on the PC, I probably wouldn't play it very much. Just like I don't play this very much anymore. But... I think it makes for a fun stream. Uh, okay, so... Silver Bignot over here. Skyrim on Switch should have new funky mode. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I totally agree with that. By the way, no one said that. I just made that up. Not a single person in chat said it should have funky mode. Someone said on the PC it has funky mode. Uh, okay, so... I think... I'd like to do some fun quests. Do you like fun questing? Well, when I say fun questing, I mean I'm going to be making armor and bows for the next three hours. Enjoy the stream! Okay. 
Okay. Doesn't take too long. Yeah. Look at all that. I need to hit smithing uh, level 60. Which I'm still quite a ways off, so... I guess, fuck all that. We've gotta get on with these. Fuck all that. Okay. Okay. So, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get rid of some of the heavy... Um, things I have here. And, uh, wow, that's a lot of gold that I have. I didn't think I had that much gold. That's pretty good. Right, so, I have... All this extra shit. Get rid of some horker tusks. I said my main goal in this game, of course, is to kill as many horkers as I can find. I want to set some kind of world record. But yeah, I mean, you know, usually when you do a stream or when you think about possibly uh, starting something like an entertainment thing, like what I do. You, you want to make it as interesting as possible, as early as possible. But yet here I am in menus, going through all the stuff. Boring the audience to tears. Vinny, what's your favorite alcoholic drink? Um, I usually do Maker on the Rocks, but I, I'd be lying if I said I liked the way it tasted. It's just, I'm, I'm used to it. Um, I like a white Russian. I like a Guinness. Yeah, a couple things there. Did you know, someone in chat mentioned Blade Runner beer, which does not exist. Did you know that Johnny Walker released a limited edition Blade Runner bottle? And the bottle looks exactly like it does in the movie. The first movie. It's like a hundred bucks. Okay, so now that I've mentioned Blade Runner, we can continue. Okay, so this is the um, Dawn Guard quest. Here we go. Troll Fat and Daedra Heart. Okay, so this is a quest I started last time I streamed the game. And I'm going to be able to show you the uh, conclusion of it. Faster. What are the sun is it's, it's what? <laughs> what what? She just gave up. Oh, I gotta sell some bows, right? Before I do that, let me grab a Daedra heart. I got plenty lying around. Just in case um a Daedra friend needs a heart transplant. What you do is you just inject some stem cells directly into the heart area. The the aorta, I believe. The, it, aorta, correct? Yeah. Good. Wow. If you had told me that this would one day be a bad idea, I wouldn't have believed it. So how about that, uh... Oh, here we go. How many do they need? I'll, I'll take two with me, just in case. You never know when you're gonna need an extra heart. Did I... Um... Oh, no, I'm good. Alright. I thought that was a glitch. I just... I never know what to expect with this game. So, the X-Files episode the other day was good. And it was somehow written by Chris Carter. The dude who's been, like, running the, the show into the ground since it came back. But it, it felt like a good episode, but it also kind of felt like fan fiction. Which isn't... a terrible thing, I guess. If the writing was decent. But it kind of felt like a 
a pretty good classic episode. I was very pleased with it. It, it seems like the first episode was the worst, and it seems like the past two were pretty good. I'm hoping the next will, will also be good. I'm not spoiling anything. But I'm pretty, um... Mulder looked... His face looked less facey in, in that episode, too. Like, it felt like classic Mulder again. And, uh, uh, Scully's always amazing. So, uh... Yeah, I'm pretty happy. Got a couple good episodes of a show that should not exist again. Can't complain too much. I will stay right here and wait for you to bring me what I... Excellent. Now, you must come with me. You become a part of this. You must be present for the ritual. Do you want to buy a couple of uh, dwarven bows, by chance? I've got like 34 of them, almost. Come said, on. what? What the fuck? Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was like, what did I do wrong? <laughs> this fucking game. It never disappoints. Okay, I still need archery 60 before I uh, level that up, so... I'm gonna hold off. Uh, I do need better arrows. Let's see... What would be... Good. Ah, oh, wrong fucking shout. God damn it. Hey, Melon Nose. Who said, Hey, Melon Nose? What does that mean? I did? Oh. I don't know, I think these, uh, dual Dawnbreakers are a little fucking broken, what do you guys think? Whoa, where'd you come from? Oh, one of the orcs died. I wonder if- I wonder if he was quest vital. almost at capacity. I gotta start selling some of this shit. It's still alive! It's Krokemeyer from Super Metroid! Wow, that one went fast! Holy shit! That was the best thing a chat member ever told me. Huh. I'd be willing to blame the dragon bones on that one. The second best thing a chat member ever told me was that be careful with the dragon bones, they can crash your game. Which is exactly why I quick saved. So how are you chat? How's how's things going? on Saturday. Back to the bones. I hope you have learned to be their master. I wonder if it corrupted my save. That would be cool. Oh, thanks, Zeet. That's cool. 
uh, pretty decent, good, good. Um, well, I hope you're all a little bit better now that we've just seen my game crash. I'm okay. I had a busy day, and then it turned into a headache, but I did make some pretty fucking badass burgers for dinner tonight. I finally finished Call of Duty World War II campaign, and um, it was so cheesily predictable, like the story. It, the game was fine. The shooting was fine. I said it before. It scratched the itch of wanting a World War II um, campaign. Didn't blow me away. Kind of made me laugh. Y you know when a game is trying to take itself seriously and you just start laughing at the characters? That's not good. They tried. It's no world at war, but it was it was okay. Who's there? Whoa, whoa, that noise. So let's see what happened here. So the bones ended up here, which probably confused the shit out of whatever residents are in this area. It, it just looks like a dragon is going for, uh, some water. Wait, don't I have an active quest? It's just me and my mother at the mill here. My father is gone. We don't know what happened to him. Oh. I hope you're not here to start some trouble. I'll fight you if I have to. They- I don't think- I don't think they let you kill kids in Skyrim. Uh, I feel bad anyway, I mean... I just split open the universe. And created like a PU. Parallel universe. Are you an angel? My name is Anakin and I'm a person. Say what you want about Jake Lloyd in The Phantom Menace. Yes, we're now talking about The Phantom Menace. It was just a shitty role. And it was written very stiff. He did the best he could, and the poor kid did not deserve the hate. Oh wow, this like entire fucking... like clan was wiped out. People getting wiped out? Hayden Christensen did a good job in episode 3. Again, bad dialogue. But... I think he genuinely had a decent screen presence, and I... It almost worked for me. Like, when I was a kid, I bought it. Later on in life, I didn't buy it so much, but... If we're talking about, like, child actors, Jake Lloyd... Maybe wasn't the best, but it was more the script. And Hayden was already, like, almost an adult when he was Anakin, and I think he was fine. Just not... I don't know, who could they have gotten to do a better job, I wonder? It is time, oh. Mars. You bring an outsider here, and now insist I call on Malakath for help. When he has clearly forsaken me. You try my patience, Atub. Doing nothing will not grant our tribe relief from this curse. What tribe? We They're all try. dead. Uh, fine. Let's get this over with. Also, I watched a video today about how The Last Jedi has no direction. 20 minute video about how the movie was pretty good. You know, directed well, looked nice, um, had some good moments, but very little direction, which is the fault of, like, Disney and, um, JJ and Ryan Johnson, because they wanted to do a new trilogy without a plan from the beginning. And then it makes the comparison that the prequels had a fairly straightforward now, and planned out story that was semi-compelling, but also just executed poorly. 
and I thought it was a very interesting video. I don't remember what the name of it is, so I couldn't tell you how to search for it. Maybe, um, just The Last Jedi is directionless, something like that. But, um, I still like the movie. I, I just thought it was a very a good opinion about it. And I think it also makes the prequels work a little bit better for me because it's like, okay, yeah, there's some interesting ideas here. Okay. Coruscant, cool. The Rise of the Emperor, cool. The Fall of Anakin, cool. Uh, are you an angel? Oh. We beseech you, aid us in our yeah. time of need. Why are we bothering with this? You pathetic weakling. What is this? What's that? Malakath has heard my pleas. He speaks to us. I like befriending you Daedris. Dare summon me, Yamars. What? Oh, what Serana. This? Come on, you I'm looking don't at a thing. You deserve to call yourself an orc. You're weak. You're small. And you're an embarrassment. You let giants, giants, overrun my shrine. Bring me their leader's club as an offering, and I might release you from this curse. Guess who's gonna have to do that? Malakath has spoken, Yamars. Your path is clear. Very well. You, outsider, come here. I want a word. This is all your fault, you know. No, it's I'm not. I'm stuck fighting a giant now, thanks to you. So you're going to help me. All right, You're yeah. going with me, and you're going to make sure I don't have any trouble reaching that giant. Don't worry. Killing giants is my speciality. This giant, it's not the only thing in the Fallowstone Cave. Getting to it isn't going to be easy. You're going to clear a path to the giant so I can conserve my strength. I'll make sure you're paid for it. So you meet me at Fallowstone Cave, and I'll get this over with. I can have my tribe back, and you can... You can leave Isle us alone. or wheel. All right. Listen. I'm just happy to be killing shit. If it means a reward and good favor of a demon, that's cool. Also, your bow is literally going through your body. That's not your bow, that's your helmet. I, my mistake? Carry on. <laughs> Carry on! I think, um, say what you want about Skyrim as a complete package or as an overrated piece of schlock as, uh, you know, limited compared to the previous games. Say what you want about the game. The soundtrack? It's fucking great. Maik oh shit, it's Maik! Maik knows many things, no? What's, what's the orc doing? Some like taking friends on adventures. Maik thinks being alone is better. Less arguing about splitting treasure. It's quite a reputation you have. Don't try blocking if you have two weapons. You will only get confused. Much better to hit twice anyway. It's not really a lie. It's more of an opinion. Uh, Mr. Orc Dude, you're gonna have to wait a minute. Todd the Liar. Saranor. Them clunky ass animations. Oh, wait a minute. Don't I have a shout that allows me to go faster? I do. I do. I do. Hang on. So I, I also have a dragon soul for unlocking other stuff. Oh, well, there's the throw voice. I could upgrade that. I could also get Elemental Fury. Yeah, I think I want that. Whirlwind Sprint. That's the one. Woo! 
doesn't really... <laughs> doesn't make me go that fast. There's a dude named Bethesda Todd. There are like seven Todds in chat right now. Is there a Jape Todd in chat? This whole Vinny the developers in chat thing is getting out of hand. Granted... Granted, I'm surprised at how many times chat has been right about that over the past couple weeks. But, uh, yeah. I would love if Todd was in the chat and I can, like, you know, ask him questions and have him, like, change topic. Todd says that you should use a two-handed weapon at all times. Where are we going? You could say the Ratway is the city under the city, dark. I do know this. Whatever happens with this orc and the fighting of the giants, then I found a mod that changes Mike the Liar to Todd the Liar. <laughs> I, uh, I'm not surprised. I, I gotta be honest. Fellowstone Cave is to the east of Riften. Cool. Well, while I'm here... I'm gonna sell my bows. Because... Oddly enough... The Thieves' Guild have the best prices. They don't rip me off. And they have a lot of gold, like the, the... If you need marksman training, and you've got the coin... What is this? I'm Are you guys like... To teach you. Together? Alright, alright. Um... Mm hmm? Who's the... Who's the dude? Or rather... I... No, 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 no. I need to find the person, uh, the shop person. Who's the shop person? What's their name? I forgot. It's been a little while. Anyway, this is a wretched hive of villainy and scum. And this is the Thieves Guild. And I have the Thieves Guild armor, but I didn't do any of the other quests, so I, unfortunately, don't have the best equipment. So, you're Brynjolf's new protege, eh? No, I'm Brynjolf. That's my nickname. Need a few spare septums? I got the cure right here. Hey, where do you think you're going? We have work to do. It's one thing. There you Welcome are. Welcome to the cozy little family. I'm one of the lookouts for the guild. I give special rates to members of the Thieves' Guild. Show me what you've got. Okay, well, I've got... fuckloads... of dwarven bows. And they're all yours at the incredibly low rate of... Wait a minute. Now. I have a thing that can give me better prices. Prices are 20% better. It's been a long time. If you're looking for extra work, talk to Vex or Delvin. They'll fix you up. Vinny, you should finish the Thieves Some Guild. Well, junk. Me? I did the I Thieves Guild treasures. when the game first came out, and I enjoyed the quest line. I did the Nightingale stuff. I did the Brotherhood. So I did quite a bit of the Guild stuff. But I haven't done it again because I wanted to experience some of the newer stuff. There we go. 
Now, if you'll excuse me. I hear even the simple jobs are becoming difficult. I hear uh, we all have the same voice. It is me, Brynjolf! That's my favorite nickname for myself now, by the way. Oh, yes. To make a sharp right. There you go. But yeah, this crown that I have is a really... If you weren't here for the previous stream, it's a really kind of amazing thing. It allows me to carry uh, 100 more. Because it's the steed stone. It's a blessing that we imbued into the crown. That said, Croesus is better for archery. So I guess if if I didn't need the extra carrying capacity at the moment, I would go for Croesus. Talos. Oh. Okay, so now we have to find the orc up here. Okay, shouldn't be too hard. Did you end up selling anything? Uh, I sold, like, what, ten? Ten bows? Vinny, how do I play Skyrim without soiling it with booby mods? Willpower. Willpower, my boob. Who's in chat? Devo? We are Devo. D-E-V-O. Can't get no satisfaction! That one? Like that, Devo? Holy shit, Devo's in chat. <laughs> Whose side am I on? The side of the wolf or the spider? Sounds like a fucking Bob Dylan lyric. There must be some kind of way out of here. Said the spider to the wolf. All right, this stream has had now 200% too much singing. I guess we're on the spider side, thanks to Serana. I don't think I would be comfortable like hanging out with an undead raised spider that is now forced to be on my team, thanks to Serana taking the uh, incentive. Like, no thanks. I'm not making camp with a spider. Gonna have to pass on that. Oh, what's going on here? What the fuck is going on here? Good job, you guys. That's that's amazing. You really that's a that's a really fantastic thing that you've done. I think they're on a quest. They have to retrieve uh, 14 bear asses and bring it back to a dwarven ringleader. Hello, who are you? Never mind. Are we just killing more bears? Okay. This is a very dangerous region. Get you. 
I got you, Serana. Oh, never mind. Serana can take care of herself. They're not questioning the undead spider. I swear, every wanderer who shows up in White Run looks weaker than the last. Oh, I don't like those noises. Fortune and glory, friend. Fortune and glory. Ah! Oh, those are juicy noises. Oh, I don't like it. Get it out of here. Soon enough, it'll be me. In the meanwhile, the Circle handles our daily routine, and Codlack advises them as Harbinger. Okay. Oh, thank God for mm -hmm. that. Oh, oh, you stepped in it! Ah, oh, It's fucking gross. This is actually just an advanced preview of Valenwood. Elder Scrolls 7. They're gonna skip 6. And then Todd will just lie and say that it existed, and he has no idea what people are talking about. Another cave. I've spent enough time There's underground myself, but if you want to go in, I'm, I'm right behind you. Let's just get this over with. Oh, of course, because Malakath would take pity on us if only a useless outsider would lend us a hand. Let's get this over with. You bet. I think next-gen forests could look cool if done right, because I've talked about forests in video games and how uh, it took a while for them to, to start looking decent. But I think we have, we have the technology and the power to make a cool looking forest. But it's just gonna feel like a more detailed Cyrodiil. We need a truly unique and interesting setting for the next Elder Scrolls game, which is why I think we should go to SPACE! It, well, it's not, Saran. It's a video game. Saran is becoming self-aware. Alright, listen. Orc. I know you like to rush in and bash people on the head with your stick. Your pointed stick. I do things my own way around here. I sneak around. Okay, I'm like the wind. They don't notice me. They never notice me. And then, it's too late, and they get stabbed. They never notice me. I guess until they do, which is frequently. Archer doing God's work. I need to level up my archery anyway, so. Oh, that's cute. That wasn't the giant, right? Look how gross that is. Ugh. Because if that was the giant with the club, the club kind of just went through the, the floor. Oh, look at that layer of leaves floating. I'm holding Todd personally responsible for everything that's, like, even mildly fucked up 
Even if he had nothing to do with it. Floating leaves? Todd? And by far the best part of the switch port, aside from the um, portability, is being able to feel the lock. God damn it. Just trying to prove a point. Hi, Joel. By the way, how you doing? I guess I should ask you. I guess I'm curious. What's your favorite Elder Scrolls game? I know most people would probably say Morrowind. But, uh... Morrowind or Oblivion. I, I like, uh, I didn't play Morrowind, but I, I really loved Oblivion. I loved the setting. I loved the fucking Oblivion gates. I loved being the, the hero of Kavach. But, uh, yeah. I know they're, like, porting Morrowind over to Skyrim. I say they, I mean, like, modders. I think they're calling it Skywind. So, I mean, never say never. There's maybe a one day I would play it. But, uh, it's not on... It's a, a definite... It's a definite no for the moment. The Oblivion Gates were sadly kind of boring in my... my I like the setting, but they were a little... They were a little boring. Also, this giant is vibrating. Uh, dude, you gonna do anything about that? Should I just watch this happen? I'm- I'm setting my controller down. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there we go. I told you I'm not helping out! I told you! But you didn't believe the- that archery 60 archery 60 means extra speed uh, wait a minute who's this now this orc has been dead for like three days fucking smells like death and like really pungent cheese. Saran is like, we have a new friend! that fun noise? Is that a bear? Double bear. How about we send the thing that smells like feet to destroy the bears? Hang on, the game's a little... You probably have noticed this. The game's a little loud. Cut it back a little bit. Aw, you got a friend request! Must have run off. Good 
fucking hit. Okay, some body parts, some ribs that still haven't had all the blood licked off them. Such a waste. It's perfectly good blood. I was always told, don't waste food. There are starving orcs in the world someplace. Don't waste food. And look at all this food. That's the real crime. That's why we gotta put the giant down. Is that a cool bird? Looks like we got a new hat for my cow! Why is the no bully thing? Someone uh, said no bully, because I, I guess I just killed an innocent bird. But how come that's usually accompanied by an anime girl emote? Are anime girls like the official like symbol of no bullying? Oh man. Why is Pants Pantsuchan? It's a reference to an anime in particular. Okay. I got it. I understand now. Interesting. What am I even doing up here? Seranor. So this bow I got on stream, and it's called the Zephyr, and it's a uh, special attribute is that it's 20% uh, faster than other bows. So it's already pretty fast, but once I get the extra 20% speed, it's going to be wonderful. And then one of the reasons I want to get to uh, level 60 with my smithing is so I can upgrade it further. And it will just be beastly, and then I can be a sneaky archer yet again. The thing I didn't want to be. A stealthy arrowman. Stay on your guard. Oh wow, this place looks fucked up. Love it. Where'd you come from? No, no. Oh. Oh well. There goes that. All right. These giants have good eyes. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're supposed to let the orc fight him. Oh, you're right. That's right.
where is the orc? Oh, I have to talk to the orc before entering the grove. Don't make a mess of this. Weeks? Longer? Feels like an age has gone by. Alright, right, dude. You ready? Let's go. Fight well. Go! Go! Okay! of this. Go. All right. I'll go kill this giant. Unless, of course, you'd like to make some extra gold. I'm tired. I haven't slept well in weeks. You kill the giant. Bring me the hammer. We go back to Lagerspur. I tell everyone I did it. Oh. You keep your mouth shut, and I pay you handsomely. No. Fine. Then wait here. This should only take a second. Okay, I'm <laughs> I'm going to guess that the giant is going to strike him, Mine. killing him instantly. <sighs> Wait a minute, the giant's not even attacking. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh. Completed protect Yarez, that was me protecting him. your arm holy shit my character's arm like turtled All inward right. I'll go kill this giant Unless, of course, you'd like to make some extra gold. Ah, uh, no, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna... Then wait here. This should only take a second. I'm still gonna let you take care of this. Stay on your phone. <sighs> you come from? Instantly dead. That, that time, the orc did not get a single hit in. Go, Serana. Right, that, that's really impressive.
Did my last Your arrow Mars was a fool. Always trying to scheme his way out of responsibility. But you took care of him and the giants. Two problems solved at once. Now, take Shagrul's hammer back to Largishburg, and we'll see about whipping the rest of them into shape. Is there genuinely no hitbox in the giant's head? Uh, by the way, Serana is just totally missing. Serana? Serana? Are you up here? Serana? I, I guess maybe she went to space and just never came back. I, I don't know. I didn't see her go to space. She got launched into space right in front of you. Really? Oh, maybe I wasn't paying attention to it? I didn't see it. Can I- can I get the clip? Speaking of clip, you sure we didn't, like, get her clipped into the ground? Cause what goes up must come down, and she's still not down. What's my least favorite Pink Floyd album? Amagoma, I guess. Not if she entered stable orbit. Oh, okay. Alright, so, uh, confirmed Serana is in orbit at the moment. Loot orc? I did. Eat pant? I did. Yeah, momentary lapse is pretty bad too. The other orc. Alright, looks like there's a bit of ore, so before I do anything, let me take care of this. Here's the clip of Space Serana. Okay, good. This is important. I need to see if this actually happened. All right, that, that's really I almost don't believe it. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, this isn't just... Th this isn't just bad. She got launched with the speed of a thousand suns. L let me show you this fucking thing. This is really... This is an impressive launch. It was so quick, I didn't notice it. Look at that! Did you see it? If you blinked, you missed it! We gotta slow it down. Oh, that's wonderful. There she go. Oh, there she goes! And on an angle, too. So, as a result... Yeah, she's just gone. What else got launched? What was that, a skull? The Giants Club also forced a skull into orbit. Serrano's in space! 
Serranas and space. What you doing up there, man? What, what, uh, what other orc did I miss? Any, any of these orcs? Loot the armored orc. I, I, well. This one? What if I don't want this stuff? Because I, I had uh, looted that particular orc. And it's just a lot of... I mean, I'll bring, I'll bring the one thing with me to sell. But I'm not going to take all that stuff. But no, I see what you mean. You just wanted me to grab that stuff so I could sell it. No, you're right. It's money. It's money. It is. But it's also... More time I have to spend at a store. And I'm- I'm lazy. Especially if I'm streaming. But I'll take that one thing with me, because it's a thousand. I wonder if that's the skull that launched. But yeah, I guess it happened, like, right here, right? So... Maybe Serana really is in space. It's a shame there isn't, like, um, a call horse function for your follower. <laughs> for your follower. And you could just, like, whistle. Listen, when I fast travel, she'll come back. But I just find it fascinating that I was able to completely lose Serana. It's totally gone. This is a good game. A good game. Bethesda leaves bugs like this in the game if they're funny and not game-breaking because it's funny. I, I believe it to some extent. I mean, the giant space program was, uh, like, viral for them. People post funny clips of it. Um, I think they fix the game-breaking stuff, generally. I mean, I've had crashes. We, we just witnessed one. I can see why they would leave the giant thing in. I, I, it's genuinely kind of amazing. Alright, well, I have a new companion now. Let's get it nice and clean. Okay. Clean. How do I how do I get you out of here?
Don't make me summon my horse. Okay. Resurrect the hawk. Yeah, but I just made it back here. I really don't... That's a great idea, though. All right, fine. Alteration, is it? Ah, what's it under? Conjuration, raise zombie. It doesn't work. It, it won't work on a hawk. Yeah, you're right. Well, well. Oh, I thought that was Serana. I actually thought that corner was a figure, was Serana looking at me. I was about to say, where have you been? <laughs> it was just a rock. <laughs> what the fuck? Apparently a couple other people <laughs> thought it was <laughs> thought it was Serana as well. Oh, it's dementia? Okay. Alright. Well, if you need me, I'll be in the home with Mike Stoklaza. She's gone, Vinny. You need to move on, mate. I, I Listen, I didn't see a body. Speaking of not seeing a body, there was, um... This deli by the studio... That we used to go to. Well, we still do. It had a worker... That was very conspiracy theory. Like, he would tell all of the people that came in... His newest conspiracy theories. I don't remember the specific ones, but... I just remember, uh, Joe going in there and, and telling me, like... He would say, like... Where's the bodies, man? Where's the bodies, man? And... So one time I go in there, I go to get a cup of coffee... And the dude's getting done telling someone else... Some rando... Like, who's just trying to buy some fucking bread... Uh, the conspiracy, whatever it was... And as I was walking out, I heard, WHERE'S THE BODIES, MAN?! And it, like, faded away. Oh, welcome back, Serana. It's not as good as- Why you not work, darling? In our stronghold, Outlander. The fuck? You requested my help. You were the one who brought- You were the one who brought me in here. In our stronghold, Outlander. You literally hired me. I don't know how you stand it. But what of your Mars? I see. He did not survive. He. He died well. Yeah. Yeah. Well. Um. It was one hit. The giant uh, crushed his skull instantly with a single blow. Your Mars didn't get a single strike in. Ah, that is good to hear, then. Yamaras was a coward and a weakling. His deceitful ways have cost you all greatly. So he has been punished. And what of us? What fate shall we suffer? You'll have to prove yourselves, but I'm willing to give you a chance. Gullerzo's in charge now. Let's hope he's a better chief. You place that hammer on the shrine. You're the only one who's proven worthy in all of this.
Oh. Wow, look at that thing. That's okay. Yeah. Great. No one complained. Massive. I am surprised that Gullah. Where'd you come from? <laughs> Kinda not as amazing as you think, given how it looks. It took me that long to kill him. Then again, my two-handed is like really weak, so... Oh, thanks, Serana. Tribal orcs are all dead. But then, even though it's just a video game, I still feel bad about what I've done, and I have to load the save file because I have no idea why. I have some level of weird compassion for innocent video game characters. I, I don't get it. Anyway, thanks for the hammer that I'll never use. Oh, that bucket is stuck in the rock there. I was really hoping I could, like, try to glitch the horse with it. I don't even know if it's possible to glitch horses, but I'm gonna try. Oh, I didn't want to take the bucket. I just wanted to get in the bucket. I kind of wanted to give the, the horse a hat for this compelling stream that I'm doing at the moment. I can't pick it up again. Alright, forget about it. Okay, more quests, more things, more glitches. out of here real quick. Wouldn't want any stray giants walking by and being like, oh, they killed, they killed Derp. Or whatever, Dirk. Dern. We need a good giant name. Uh, Dernbog. Dernbald. Nilbog. Wow. Or Frank. Yeah, Frank the Giant. That's fine. Dirt. <laughs> no, no one bothered to tell him what the word dirt meant. In giant language, dirt just means brave warrior. Oh, you're- oh, but- hey, wait, wait a minute. I'm an Argonian, too. I've read the lust the Argonian made. God damn it. Everyone's putting a hit out on me.
all these fucking notes I have. Well, two. <laughs> Alright, I'm complaining about two hit jobs, that's fine. Could be worse. Right, Mike? Mike knows many things, no? Hmm? Don't try blocking if you have two weapons. Going for a swim, Mike. Mike? Hmm? Mike is done talking. Mike is done talking. Come on. Come on, get in, get in the water. Come on now. Mike is done talking. Hmm? Go, go on. Swim. Cats don't like water. They don't like to take baths. But you're a dirty boy. <laughs> you need to be cleaned. Mike. <laughs> there we go. Oh man, I was really hoping Mike would just continue, like, floating downstream. I really, really wanted to witness that. Oh, no, 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 Serana, no, don't kill. Serana. You, you sh oh. Oh. Mike is done talking. Oh. Yeah, well, I'll say. Serana cannot Must process be this. Must be gone. Must be gone now. Must be gone now. Must be gone now. Uh. <laughs> oh, fuck. God, I love this game. Yeah, space fried her fucking brain. She passed the Van Allen belt, got irradiated, and come came back down. Go back into the water. Mike is done talking. Mike no, go is done swim, talking. swim, my friend, swim. Mike is done talking. Swim. Mike. Is All right. Just wasting time anyway. At least we baptized Mike. Oh. Well, stuff like that's bound to happen. Shoot first and ask questions later, huh, Serana? Maybe we could have reasoned with them. It's like that scene in Monty Python. And now we've already got one! They've already got a Holy Grail! 
Oof. Oh, man, I, I guess I kind of deserve that, huh? That, it was a friendship arrow. They didn't shoot first. There was- it was a love arrow. It was a message arrow. Uh... There's a piece of paper rolled up on the arrow that I was supposed to read. I'm just gonna discover the location. I wanna do some, um... I wanna do some quests. I don't know which, uh, what quest to do, but I'm sure I have several. Could wait tonight and then just like sneaky deaky my way through that with a knife. That's the first time Serana has said that. That makes sense. But I'm detected. Okay. This is good. I want to level up my... Oh. God. Really, Skyrim? Twice in one night? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. What the fuck? Mother of fuck! Right in the armpit. what I was trying to say. To today, huh? But it looks like this is just a... a castle of death. Oh, nice sound. Great, now the game is corrupted. Are the arrows really just going right through the fucking dude? Okay, I've had enough. Also keeps defaulting back to these shitty farmer arrows. God, I hate them. Oh, I'm out of steel arrows. Okay, no wonder. No, I'm leveling up on you. And it's your own goddamn fault. <laughs> I guess he really did take an arrow to the knee. Alright, archery.
Oh fuck, that's 30% faster. And I can't do that until I hit 70. It's, it seems I've miscalculated. Well, this is the one I wanted. I got a little ways to go yet. This one is more damage. Dual wielding attacks are 35% faster. Yeah, Steady Hands isn't actually that amazing, is it? Never mind, I guess I won't ever have to think about it or worry about it, because now I don't have it. Why no overdraw? I don't know, I guess I should do that instead. Considering everything that just happened, didn't happen. Who's there? You know I something? I can- I can go back and level. You'll notice I'm not very good at this game. Okay, yeah, that bandit is just too powerful. I'm not really... Uh, I'll hold off, and then I'll get, um... I'll get overdrawn now. happening. Steady hand, overthrow. There we go. I I'll level my archery on easier targets, like this deer. I tried to lead my shot. Thanks, chat. Good advice. Lead your shot, Vin. You said- what? what? Oh, it was an elk. Joe Rogan would love the meat. I hear bear, I do not see bear. Right up the arse. for the bear. What happened to your crossbow? You know, I know there's upgrades for the crossbow. I didn't either find them or I didn't get to them yet. But you can actually upgrade the crossbow. Sometimes throughout my life, I will be just like cleaning, 
cooking, and I'm like, do not fear! I should use hist skin as well. Yeah. Good shit. Dragon helped. See, the dragon brought a skeleton. And once again, Serana is missing. Okay. For real. Vin, you got a disease. Oh. What else is new? All right. Reduce stamina. Oh yeah, we don't want that. Here we go. Why do we have to go? There was nothing that we couldn't have accomplished by speaking. Where'd you come from? Good timing, Serana. What's the thing that hurts your bones in the game? Oh, it's a, what's it called? Rock jo joint or something like that? Right? Not bonitis. You, you drink the bone hurt juice and you get rock joint in the game. Bone break fever? <laughs> Sounds, are you sure that's not just a Ted, Ted Nugent song? Ted, they call him. Because Ted Nugent takes too long to say, so they just call him Ted. Gotta discover some locations for no good reason once again. It's one of those just get lost going on an adventure type games. Not think too hard about what you have to do next and just walk. Fucking gross. There's a cave like right here. doing over there <laughs> what oh that was the helper I love how even if I want to take mercy on my enemies, Serana will not allow it. OK. 
Okay, I have the Orioles bow. Um, there's a book here. Okay. Uh. The Shrine of Talos. I don't know what is going on there. That's never going to happen. Well, the full member of the Thieves Guild could happen, not the other one. Uh, there's the Thieves Guild stuff. There's the main quest. I don't know what that is. Do the archery side quest of Falkreath. Okay. Say no more! Update some archery sounds good. Or upgrade, unlock. And then I'll do, uh... Bothia. Get Roda. I need to also remove my fucking rabies that I received. I can do that in Falkreath, right? You. You were talking to that murderous savage. And then he escaped. Before you hide him. I mostly deal with petty thievery and drunken brawls. Been too long since we've had a good bandit raid. Um, let's see, so, go to any shrine. So I don't know if there are any Try shrines. Try not to judge Falkreath too harshly, visitor. The war has been hard on us. Don't see anything out in the open. Use a cure disease potion. Easy enough. I don't have one. Very opposite of easy enough. Shrine is by the graveyard. Oh yeah. Remember how I wanted to see ghosts in the graveyard? You're all right. And I ended up doing a ghost quest that was totally unrelated to the graveyard. I swear there's a quest here or some like event that happens where a bunch of fucking spooky skeletons come back to life and then you have to like go on an adventure into a mansion with a wacky dog um you know a nerdy girl and like a dude named Fred and then from there you find out it was never ghosts and Daphne citizen All right, so, uh, gents. Ladies and gents, I have to ask you a question. Where is that... Where's that archery quest? Who do I speak to? Vinny, what are the metal nipples all over my jeans? What are they for? Oh yeah, I have those too. out fighting dragons and what do I get? God. The archery quest is a little south. Okay. It's up the mountain. Well, I'll pose a counter question to you, Desert. Why do guys have nipples? Nature works in mysterious ways. Same for pants. But if you want, you could ask Pansu chan oh, That's my own original character, by the way. Do not steal Pansu chan Please, um, ask for permission before you use the character, thanks. I'll be putting out a, an anime television show on Netflix soon. Pansu Chan Crybaby.
then it's on your compass. This like little house there. Is is that the house? How the fuck do I get up there? I know of only one way to get up there. Use amiibos, no. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Again. I can climb the holy mountain horizontally. Yeah, just, just stop, please. Let, just, <laughs> just stop this, Todd. gonna be okay. No, I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm not! <laughs> oh. That was a brief heart attack, though, wasn't it? Man. It's been that long since I saved. Fuck. Alright, no, I can... I can get up the mountain better than that. Vinny... Okay, let's see. Vinny, there's a trail leading to the house a little southeast of the village. You know... I should have... I should have known that. Whatever the fuck it was I was trying to do could not have been the correct way to get up there, but... I don't know. You, this is why... To that this is why it's tough going from Breath of the Wild to Skyrim. Okay, so southeast, you say? Okay. Okay. Why didn't you ask Tingle for his balloons? Tingle's a little bit busy doing um, some other strange things at the moment. So that game took a bit of a weird turn, didn't it? All I'm going to say is that when I continue streaming the Tingle game... It's, uh, friendship. Tingle just wants to be friends with everyone. That's the way I'm going to be looking at it. Just buying some gifts, making some friends. It's funny because before the game came out, I thought it was just like you're in a bunch of balloons. And you go from world to world and you do like balloon fight stuff. Hello there, friend. How lucky for you to chance upon a bard on the road. For a generous fellow traveler. But of course, what would you like to hear? All right then. This must be that beautiful sky. Did I just give him 25 gold and then back out and not have him play a song? What? Uh, 
consider it charity. How the fuck? And yet again, this thing, it's so high up. I... Vinny, I finished your K-Pasa Neng stream. Holy fuck, that was obnoxious. You- you think that's bad? It's been getting a little bit, uh... It's been getting a little crazy, I'd say. People have been, um... Hitting up those Neng memes pretty hard lately, like... I think we're gonna need some withdrawal soon. Nengaholics Anonymous, you know? Whatever the case is... Keep in mind that Neng is... It was supposed to be satire. As obnoxious as the character is, he was supposed to be the chosen one. No, he was actually, you know, a, a dude, an actor, who wanted to satire and make fun of the, um, the, like, club music culture of Spain. And yet, much like how me making fun of my nicknames by creating the nickname Binyat, has created Binyat as my nickname. Neng himself has become incredibly obnoxious. But I get a chuckle out of it. Just going in like raw. <laughs> I mean blind. Going in blind without knowing anything about the, the character was a very strange experience. You cannot go that way. I really don't know how to get to this hut. Ben, what was your favorite game to stream in 2017? Uh, Breath of the Wild. I did a top 10 already. Which, of course, was... Um, all, uh, you know, my kind of personal favorites of the year. Not like a definitive list of what I think was the best game. However, you know... Not everybody sees it that way. Some people don't like Breast of the Wild. However, what the fuck is this? I'm just going to go to this area and then go left. It's, it, like, way too high up. When people were saying there was a quest in Falkreath for archery, I thought it was a dude in Falkreath. Let's get indoors. Or in a cave. Anywhere, just out of place. God, excuse me. I don't mean to yawn on stream. But someone typed Y, another person typed A, another person typed W. All throughout sentences, I saw it and I was like inspired to yawn. That's how contagious yawns are. It's like those uh, Star Wars memes where they take a sentence and they just isolate one letter at a time until they have a different word. <laughs> And somehow that becomes a meme.
There we go. My mom heard you swearing and asked um, what I was watching, and I said, some Italian guy. Was that a satisfactory answer to your mother about why you're watching some fucking moron screaming and cursing? I'm just wondering. Was that enough? Did she lay? Oh, okay. I gotcha. Yep, some Italian guy. No problem. Someone I know has, um, like a seven-year-old son that watches Logan Paul. And, uh, I found out that they went to the city because there was a place Logan said he was going to be. This was a couple months ago. Uh, he said he was going to be there. And, first of all, Seven is way too young for, you know, some of this stuff, in my opinion. Especially that dude. But anyway, um... Said he was gonna be at a place in, in Manhattan. And a bunch of people went, they were happy to meet him, they were ready to meet their hero, or whatever. And he just didn't show up. And did not, apparently, say anything about why he didn't show up. I was like... I felt so bad for her that, you know, poor seven-year-old kids. And then driving all the way to the city, waiting for a couple hours for the dude to show up, and then he never shows up. Oof. Name's Angie. And if you try anything stupid, I won't hesitate to put an arrow in your head. Name's Angie. And if you try anything stupid, <laughs> I won't hesitate to put an arrow in your head. Sorry, a girl can't be too careful out here. Like I said, name's Angie. Damn it, Serana. I've been living out here for a couple of years now. I moved here from Helgen after my family was killed. At the time, I couldn't stand to be around anyone. They all felt sorry for me, and I didn't want them to. It was my problem, not theirs. Two Imperial drunks who thought they were above the law. At least it wasn't a dragon. Already did. Part of the reason I'm living out here now. Thanks for offering, though. I set up those targets a long time ago. I shoot at them from time to time. Don't want to get rusty with my bow. God damn it, Serana, please. That I am. You know how to use one? Well, I'm gonna say no, not really. Because I want to open up bow. There's the one practice. on the rack to the left of the door. Excellent. Follow me to the targets and we'll begin. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> she was using the upgrade rack. She is hitting the house with a hammer. Why, Serana? Why? What are you doing? What, what are you? What are you? I, I genuinely thought she was using, using the workbench. Where, where'd she go? Oh. Okay. This fucking game. That is a clip. Let's see what you can do. Remember to stay within the boundaries and only use the practice arrows. I have some if you don't have any. Aim for the middle target. Okay. Space vampire. Yeah, and the house, the best part is the house is made of wood, but it was making the sound of metal. Oh wow. Shot. Now hit the target to the right. 
Wow, this is an amazing quest line. Even though it's not really a quest line, is it? Nice shot, right on target. Let me know if you want to practice some more. Next time we'll make it a little more challenging. I had no idea this this quest existed. Need something? Excellent. Follow me to the targets and we'll begin. My older brother took me out hunting a lot when I was little. At the time, it was difficult to keep food on the table, let alone have enough left over to sell at the market. So whenever we came across more than one deer in a single location, it was imperative we kill as many as we could. If you can learn to keep your composure and trust that each shot is true, then you should be able to quickly handle multiple targets. When I tell you to, try and hit each of the three closest targets in eight seconds. Okay, Serana, you, you best not be over there. Go. You have eight seconds to hit each of the three targets. Draw Please. And get ready. One, two, three. Hey, watch it! Time's up. Better luck. Oh, oh, I had to hit all of them. Oh, okay. I fucked up. Huh? I was just a little confused. Sure. Mm. I don't know why she said, hey, watch it. Go. You have eight seconds to hit each of the three targets. Draw string and get ready. One, two, three. Go! Be careful. You did it. All three targets in eight seconds. Didn't seem that pleased. Be careful, you said. if you want to practice some more. Next time we'll make it a little more challenging. Great job. Excellent. Follow me to the targets and we'll begin. You have to hit the metal parts and not the posts. We've okay. talked about speed and composure. Now we'll go over precision. Oftentimes you won't be able to get as close to your prey as you'd like, and you'll have to set them with a long shot. However, with such a long shot, it's more than likely that's the only shot you'll be able to take before your yep. play runs off. Tell me more. Wait a minute, why is the arrow floating? If you find yourself in such a situation, then you need to make your shot count. <laughs> Don't rush oh. your shot. Crouch down, get comfortable, and take aim. Okay, your turn. Try and hit the target way in the back, far behind the other three. Remember to take your time and make your shot count. Now my arrow is floating. I couldn't tell where the shots were landing. Next time we'll make it a little more Excellent. Follow me to the targets and we'll begin. It's so bright out here. I don't know how you stand it. We've talked about composure, speed, and precision. Now it's time to use all three at once. Okay, I may not have enough practice arrows. This challenge will be quite difficult. Wait, 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 wait. Don't explain yet. Don't explain. Whoa, son! I 
I'll count to three and then say go. You have ten seconds to hit each of the four targets. Draw a string and get ready. One, oh, two, fuck. three. did it! All four targets in ten seconds. Nice job. Huh? Is there more practice? I think I've taught you everything I know. You might even be as good as me now. Be careful. Give these shitty Falmer arrows. That was excellent for uh, my upgrades. Most excellent. 67. Just three more and I get the uh, extra speed. Plus 30% speed, not 20 like I thought earlier. There's an arrow stuck mid-air above the target in the back. Really? Yep. Yes, you are correct. Okay, well that was cool. The floating arrow, I mean. When is next curb stream? Uh, early next week? Let's see, uh, could do a couple more quests. Talk to Angie. Get, get her bow. Oh, she has- okay. There's more. I didn't realize there was more. Think about how many times in a video game you walked away from a reward. Like... For example, a free bow. Or a cool hammer. Yes? Don't be like them. Don't feel sorry for me. Remember, composure and speed. You don't need to see your arrow hit before moving on to your next target. Trust your shot is true. What do you want, lizard? <laughs> hey, don't call me lizard. Uh, but no, really, how do I get her bow? I don't, I don't know if you can. I think I've taught you. Kind of scary if I think about it. Oh, okay, I see. Um... It looks like you're no longer needed. Time to die. Thanks for helping me out. It was my pleasure. Out. It's not often I get visitors out here, let alone friendly ones. Can Thanks for up? sticking around and keeping me company. It was nice to finally meet someone out here who doesn't want to rob you or take off your head. I know it isn't much, but here, I, I... take this bow. It was given to me by my family. It's special to me. But brings back too many painful memories. So you you okay with Serana like upgrading your house? Banana, please. Remember, composure and speed. You don't need to see your arrow hit before moving on to your next target. Trust your shot is true. Why? Why? It's so weird. I mean, it's got nice sentimental value, but it kind of sucks. Ah. Uh. Uh. Yeah, that's a thing. Let's do that one fun because we'll have fun 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 and a daddy takes a dirty bird away that's my uh 
my singing voice. That was actually the Beach Boys. The voice of an angel. I type fun 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 in um, YouTube and it's uh, the first result is fun 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 meme. That's not the Beach Boy song. I don't know what. That's a meme? What the fuck is this? No, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, Jesus. Is this music happening while I'm fighting in Skyrim? Really? It's like a Quentin Tarantino movie. I got this. <sighs> oh, wait, wait, I like this part. Nah, forget about it. It's gonna be a VOD mute from my cell phone directly into my microphone in the worst quality while I'm speaking and while I'm killing things, then the algorithm is going to flag me. And then... shit can my entire channel. I'm, I'm looking forward to it. Mike Love is gonna fuck you up for that, Vin. Oh yeah, no, he'll be, he'll be suing real real soon. You could have paused the game in t instead of taking a VOD mute. Yeah, but where's the fun in that? Like I said, it looked like a Quentin Tarantino moment. Ooh, sorry. Kind of not, though. I, I, I kind of did that on purpose. I just didn't expect it would hit. Sorry for what? <laughs> don't you dare say that. No, 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 no. You don't say that. Not in my chat room. That's like bringing up Estoy Velando. We just don't bring up Estoy Velando anymore. Something amazing is about to happen. Don't move. Wow. I don't know if this is a camp of bandits or what. Oh, wow. That's a shame. That is a shame. They're hunters. They're not bandits. I'm sorry for your loss. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Aren't you at all upset about losing your two best friends? It's not like my poaching is hurting anyone. The Jarl can hardly eat every deer now, can he? Can 
I guess you don't care. I had expected East Grimoire City to be bigger. I'll make sure their equipment goes to good use. That's what I'm here for. Are those shaved pickles? No. Leeks. Grilled leeks. No. You've never... What, you've never eaten shaved pickles before? You've never even heard of shaved pickles. It's good. Next time you can, ask your family about it. They'll know. Someone in chat said, I've never eaten pickles, period. I think pickles are great. But not all pickles are great. <laughs> I've had fucking terrible, terrible pickles. Ones that, like, are just too sweet, too sour. Um, too mushy. Nothing worse than a shaved mushy pickle. Here's the cult. Oh, is that what spotted me? Oh my god. Not good. <laughs> Fucking Serana, please. Where are you? Serana, please. Wait a minute, this is a good thing. The, the Frost Troll is going into the cult. Yes, fuck them up. Yes. Yes, good! They're not attacking. Oh, yeah, they're trying to. This useless fucker. It's like, I am not getting involved. Still. Stoic. Only now. <laughs> what is happening here? <laughs> oh man, this this dude sucks. Serana to the rescue. There we go. Then you're not supposed to attack them. Oh. Oh. Uh, 
Uh, yep. Yeah. Okay, so, um, yeah, now I'll just save them from the troll instead. Okay, I can do double dawn breakers. They're fighting each other? going on here? Is this like a fighting pit? You'll beg me to kill you before I'm done. Yeah. No one seemed to give a fuck about the troll. Come on, um You still fail. Quest giver is dead. <sighs> Alright. Here I was thinking that one watch dude, watch dude, yeah, the watch dude, I was convinced was glitched. Yes. No. Fuck. Ah. God damn it. I need to- I think I need to stun the troll first. Will this work? It didn't work. Oh. Oh, god damn it. Fucking hell. Well, I listen, I got this. I'm gonna make this work. I'm saving that goddamn priestess. This is a mission for me now. I don't have Roda, I just have Foos. Um, let me see if I have any poison. Potion of Paralysis would help. Um, or anything like that. Potent Paralysis Poison. Seven seconds. It'll do. No, 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 not right now. Hello, now we can talk. Hi. Yeah, but first, um, you have a thing in your arm. We are forged by Boethius' example. We carve our will upon the world through our tongues. And our blade. Fight you, Club. You are nothing. This An empty vapor dispersed by the slightest breeze. The Lord of Plots, deceiver of nations, devourer of Trinomach. The Queen of Shadows, goddess of destruction, he who destroys and she who erases. Oh, wow. Many are our Lord's lofty names. But they befit only us mortals. Intone her mighty names from now until the end of time. It is for naught. Names mean nothing to our Lord. 
She only cares for those who care for themselves, whose hearts are full of purpose, whose lives are full of deeds. I, my life is full if of you deeds. If desire a glimpse of our dark mistress, then this is what you must do. First, prove your tongue can wield a lie. Find someone, gain his trust, lead him to the shrine above. Next, instruct your thrall to touch the Pillar of Sacrifice. Its magic will ensnare him, rendering him helpless. Then, girded with certitude, plant the ceremonial blade deeply so that the waters of his heart wash over you. If your will is strong enough, it will stir Boethia in her dark mansion, and she will appear before us. May your will carve itself upon the world. We are Ford. You are nothing. We, you, you are good. For the Lord. Okay, so uh, Serana is going to have to die here. Lord. She, if you desire first, next, then, if your will is strong, that remains to be seen. But if it is so, oh, bring if cow appears, then we will welcome you as one of us. No, that's okay. Serana, Serana's got to go. It's kind of a cool looking weapon. This is what you get for hammering that person's house, Serana. Sorry. Come on up, Serana. A well-placed word or a well-placed dagger, both can achieve equal purposes. So come on, my friend. I want to show you something. There's a cool thing at the top of this clip. Doesn't work. Let's move faster. The sun is it's not great for my skin. Serana is quest vital for um Dawn Guard. You, you can't get rid of her. Or oh, oh you have to tell her to do it. Oh, okay. Do you wish to test yourself against me? Has to be someone non-essential. Serana Banana cannot do this. No. No, it's well not happening. A well-placed word or a well-placed dagger. Though we live in shadow, we carve indelible signs of our passing into the world. Do you wish to test yourself against me? There's got to be another way. Though we live in shadow, we carve indelible signs of our passing into the world. Lydia would want to go on an adventure, smiley face, says a member of this kind and loving chat. Do you wish to test yourself against me? You can hire a mercenary. <laughs> okay. A well word or a well dagger. Both can achieve equal purposes. Alright, uh, yeah, I'm gonna get a mercenary. <laughs> this is gonna be good. Uh, let's see, where- where should I get the mercenary from? White Run has mercs. I would imagine Morthal has mercs too, right? Hunter's Lodge and White Run. Riften.
Let's see. Let's check the tavern here and see if we find anyone. You are new to Morpho. It's interesting that you have a voice the same as the one from that death cult. Oh, fuck's sake. My job is never done. This is just an excuse to hear the music. God damn it. Ah. I should just fucking go into the tavern despite the dragon. Here's the general store. This was the wrong choice. Here's the inn. Does that count as the tavern? Get Beenor? That's the character. That's the mercenary's name, Beenor? You're fucking lying. Is there something I can do for you? Yeah, can you show me Beenor? Don't fret over the gloom. There's nothing to fear. Oh, Lord, Good old Lubrick. That's the third Just time I've run into Lubrick on this stream. Until next time. That character has a starring role on the stream now. Officially. Beenor is probably outside. Okay, we gotta find Beenor. For having such a silly name, I sentence Beenor to die. Do you see what just happened here? I got a bounty, and then it was removed because I killed the last witness. Meaning the chicken. I'm a very, very lucky lizard. Also, the dragon just fucked off. this. Oh no, 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 dragon's here. <laughs> I guess, I guess I deserve that for what I did to that poor chicken. There's another enemy here somewhere. If you guys saw that. What the fuck? Why am I being attacked by a traveler? We have slightly more pressing matters at hand. I have no idea why that happened. I was a vampire. Secret vampire. <laughs> you 
You just contracted vampirism. Really? Okay, I need a shrine now. The and the dragon is gone. I can't find Beanor. Everything has gone wrong. There's a shrine here. Okay, I'm I'm gonna look for it. Dragon's back. Dragon's back and he's broken! I go up to a guard, I'm like, hey, do you know where I can find Beanor? Prostitution is illegal. Okay, so I, I still need to find Show a fucking shrine. Don't Might be indoors. Cure disease potion. I don't think I have one. I didn't have one before. Here's the guardhouse. Uh, uh, no shrine still. Oh god. Oh god, I don't want to be a vampire. There's a potion shop in town. The dragon's dead. I think Serana did it by herself. Good Ask job, Serana. Sneak thief. Are you Beanor? No. Trouble. Thalian's house. Uh, I can't really afford to wait on on this. You have a few days to cure the disease. You have three days until it settles in. Okay, so then we can... Okay, we can wait a little bit. Find Beanor. Hire Beanor. Cure vampirism. Sacrifice Beanor. And then... Stop the stream, I guess. What the fuck is going on down here? Oh, it's the... Fucking vampire dude from before, I think. <laughs> it's just some good graphics, that's all. What do you need? I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. You're the one cast those illusions. Impressive. Got to keep my eyes open. Damn dragons could swoop down at any time. Who's there? Why did this happen again? Didn't we leave Alva alone? Wasn't that a part of a quest line? Get in done and done. 
Yeah, but Serana, did we want to do that? She went through the fucking wall. Let's not go down to Alpha Cellar. I seem to remember doing a quest and leaving Alva alive. She's bad. Oh, uh, well. Whatever. She can suck the guards if she wants. Not my chair, not my problem. You're supposed to kill her? You didn't finish the quest then? I thought I did. I thought I finished that quest line. I think I found Beanor. Morthal used to be a quiet place, but then you want me to prove it? I bet a hundred gold I can take you barehanded. How do I no hire drinker? Oh well. They haven't made me a guard, even though I've been You want me to prove it? I bet a hundred just your own two hands. Weapons and magic are out. Now let's see what you got. Nice face. Come on. Let's see what you're yeah. made of. Yeah. Uh. 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 No. Uh. Uh. Just keep in mind when my lizard flesh oh, makes man. contact with Beanor's face, he gets scabies. Fist fight like this where just no one gets tired. Just repeatedly getting fucking punched in the face over and over and over and over again. Now that was a punch. You're a real fighter. I like that. Okay, now I need to hire you. You're a real fighter. I like that. You've been a good friend to me. Looks like you got someone already. Mm. What now? I'm going to we should part ways, Serana. All right. I'll meet you at Darkfall Cave. Darkfall Cave. I don't know where that is. You this got isn't it. This is the time or place. Well, let's not waste any time. All right, Beanor. You've proven yourself worthy. You beautiful bastard, you. Okay, so uh, where's the shrine in town? Is it maybe here? Dead dragon is northwest of town. Okay. Nope. God might get nervous. A man approaches with his weapons drawn. Eat hawk feathers. Wow, that actually fucking worked. I think. Yep. Thanks. Got to thinking. Maybe I'm the dragonborn, and I just don't know it yet. I bet that was not a tasty thing. I want you to really, like, vividly imagine yourself eating a feather. Uh, I don't see the dragon corpse. Where'd you say it was? Northwest? Oh, there we go. Yep, that's not that's not uh, an easy thing to miss. Just another day on the job for this guy. I 
Can't even carry the bones. That's all. Understand? Let's see. I have the crown. I have, um... This... I keep a lot of stuff with me that can increase my carrying capacity. Okay. It took its very soul. Yeah, that's what I do. Sell the orcish armor. Yeah, I kind of want. I'm gonna sell some stuff, and eventually I will drop off more at my house. <laughs> but for now, I just need to get to the treadwell store. Don't do that. And not accidentally kill a guard on the way. Do you hear what sounds like canned air? In the in your right ear every now and then. What the fuck is that? Oh, do come in. I hope I have what you need. Gold? Jorgen and I both take a look. Okay, I can't uh, actually sell the stuff I need to sell here. God damn it. Good day. Volsung increases your carrying capacity. Yes, but I have the steed on my crown, which is an extra hundred. So, I kind of need that. Give to Beenor. But if I give to Be, You know what? You're right. I'll give to Beenor and sell, and then I'll Let's take from Beenor. That's what a good idea, because I don't want him to have my dragon bones when, you know... Shit gets real. Uh, and the betrayal- I mean, the sacrifice- I mean, the, um, the party happens. Let's go. Is there a decent general store? You know what? I'll just not be too lazy about it. We're gonna take a... One way or another, I have to make a stop. So I'll just go back to my shitty house. Right quick. If, you know, if I can find my shitty house. So Serana is at a cave. It's kind of upset that Serana doesn't want to go back to the house. Hang out with Lydia. He goes, hi. When Brian Wilson goes up, he goes, ah! that's good. I always enjoy that. So that was the Beach Boys plus Doppler. Guest appearance, MC Doppler. This is 3 a.m. Vinny. No, this is, this is Vinny who streams so often that he doesn't give a fuck about anything anymore. Well, some things. <laughs> some things. This is senile dementia Vinny. I think. I'm really just gonna drop this off in the treasure chest and then never get back to it. Two 
Blades of Sacrifice. I think I need one of them, right? Yeah, I think I need one of them, maybe? I don't know. Where is... the hammer? Did I just put the hammer away? Where the fuck- Where did my crazy hammer go? Did I put it away? Am I losing my mind? Am I- Am I losing my mime? Zito, I'll give you the keys. You need to get the keys so you can stream. You never got it. You reloaded before you picked it up. We've stopped. What is it? Hmm. What do you need to take? Oops. Lead on then. I am your sword and your sheep. So uh, Lydia's like, who who this? Why you bring? I'm just like, I'm just trying to get it eight. I still have a lot of stuff that uh is unnecessarily like weighing me down. I'm gonna have to do some some more spring cleaning of my inventory, but now is not that time. Let's check in on the cow. Cow is doing well. Breathing heavily. You know, there are other animals you can get. Each animal adds another chance of glitch. New glitch per animal. It's a feature. Okay, so now we can do this thing. Vinny hypothetically asking if there were 21 plus nengs on the Buru, what would you do? I would probably demod you, Desert, because I think I- I think I would blame you. If there were 21 plus. That's- there's not been a single neng on the stream tonight. I've mentioned it. I talked about it briefly. There should be no reason for 21 of them. There's no- there's no reason for 21 you Neng. Test yourself against me. A well-placed word, or a well-placed dagger. We've stopped. What is it? Uh, yeah, I need you to do something. Fine. What? I need you to do that. Okay. A well placed word or a well placed dagger. Both can achieve equal I I this person is busy. Yeah, you could say that again. Uh, I'm sorry. <sighs> well, Why are you so far away? Tell me, why have you slept 
slain this one who trusted you here upon my shrine. Because the crazy weird lady told me to do it. I have slain Binor to gain your favor. My favor. My good pleasure is not some trophy for mortal sport. I should slay you for such insolence. Were you certain in your purpose, you would have no need to apologize. You have much to learn. But you have proven your will is strong. Wasn't even worth it. And Wasn't even worth it. Is devoid of pity. So perhaps you are not entirely useless. We shall soon find out. Listen, all of you. Hear me. I have need of a warrior. Only the most ruthless, cunning, and agile will do. Right now I'm dizzy. You have gathered here night after night, sacrificing fools upon my shrine, and starring aimlessly with yourselves. But which among you truly exceeds the rest? Prove yourselves to me. <laughs> Bim Binor. I have a special task for whichever of you is left standing. Oh my god, it's, it's a free for all. Well, I'm gonna let them take care of themselves, and then I'll finish off the winner. And that sounded really bad. Don't worry about it. And uh, I have a dragon that I can also have. Oh, oh no. Oh god, what have I done? Fly! Dunavir, go away! Thanks. Yeah, summoned boners! Sorry, what? Can you get closer? Gift for lies. You have shown ferocity and prowess in combat. Now the time has come for a final proving. Are you able to cast aside your honor and strike with the hidden blade? An astute observation. Skyrim is a beautiful and harsh mistress, but her people cling to such a petty notion of honor. My previous champion displeases me. After this mission, I'm gonna time he is wrap this up. In the traditional fashion. Went a little late tonight, but Skyrim will do that. I am loath to utter his name. One cannot erase a thing if it has a name to be remembered. For a time, he served his purpose, but that. Time In fact, I'm not even going to kill this dude. I'll do that next time. Gifts for his own amusement, and the only amusement I tolerate is my own. You will find him holed up at Knife Point Ridge. Where he plays king to bandits and highwaymen. Kill every single member of his band. Do so as silently and invisibly as you can. For this is not about you. You are to be my instrument in this. Slay him in the coldest of blood. Do not give him the dignity of defending himself. This effect hurts Once everything. Once corpse lays cold upon the ground, and all trace of his followers erased, retrieve my ebony mail. A gift fit Ooh. only for my true That chance. sounds good. Some new armor? May your will carve itself upon the world. 
That's a very silly way to die, Beanor. Wait a minute, weren't you just Beanor? Oh no, this is Beanor. How did I fuck that up? Also silly. Whoa, what, what's keeping... I know you get stiff when you die, but... It's a whole new meaning to that phrase. Okay, well apparently it's a whole dungeon, so I'm not gonna want to go through that, but at least we got to see the Beanor stuff, even if it meant going a little late. It was worth it. It was worth it. Next time, um, I stream this, I will do this quest, so wh whatever I do on my own will just be unrelated to this quest. We're gonna see it through. <laughs> of course, Beanor would have... This, this right here would be stiff. Of course it would be. All right. So thanks for watching Skyrim. Again, I know it's a six-year-old game. I know it is the uh, the very height of meme and possibly overrated, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But man, I have a lot of fun streaming it. Okay. And now the moment that I haven't looked forward to since Desert told me that there were 21 Neng. We're, we're gonna check the Buru. I'm a little frightened. Oh my god. Oh no. It's, it's as bad as it's as bad as it was warned to be. The good news is this is going to go quick. From Caffeinated Sloth, we'll start with, um, here's Tingle, but as Link. I'm assuming this is more from the Zelda randomized thing that I did. And it's awesome. Here's the first offense from uh, Neon Grass, Cape Panta Bang. No, it doesn't, no. Bang, Bart, d no. From Steampunk King, Kepaka Neng. Okay, that, that works a little bit better, yep. Uh, from v Victory Vikings, freshly picked Tingle's billion bitcoins. It's the only cryptocurrency. Ting coin. Uh, from Green Cat Kid 14, here's a Vine Shroom, Pixely. From Terribly Perfect, here's a BRB, Simply. Here's... A CGA piece by CGA. And it's it's this from Sad Vega. Okay, pasa boy. Like I said, at least it goes quick. Here's one from Shy Guy XXL. No, I swear the old man with the wings made me do it. Yeah, yeah. Tell it to the judge. Maybe I uh, shouldn't have picked a child as an example. <laughs> Yeah, it was... A <laughs> if you missed the fucking Tingle stream... Yeah. Got weird. And, uh, thank you for the art. <laughs> Good job. Here's one from Sad Vega. K Upload Vang. Oh, fuck. It's not working. From Score Scorvern. Here's some Tingle and Kakashi art. I think it's great. Here's one from Tubiel. And it's the various parts. Let's I go. It's the various parts from uh, the, the Tingle train. I didn't expect them to get some fan art, but they did. From Angi Angry, excuse me, <laughs> Angry Max Speedning. From Primal Screen Guy. Oh, not you too. No. Ernest fucking shoots himself in the in the dick. From Revor, it's just Tingle and Neng. This is truly the darkest years. 
truly the darkest years from Revor Dragon. Tingle three, tingles, pingle, dink, tingle. Okay. <laughs> With a funky mode. Here's uh, one from Shy Guy XXL. This could be a one part Speed Luigi if chat would be willing to part with the three part version. That is, that's an excellent idea. That would free up two emote slots. I don't know how you guys feel about this, but if you have any thoughts about it, maybe we can do a poll. And uh, let's just say if we consolidated Speed Luigi, yeah, it would, it would open up Vine Blind and uh perhaps some other stuff that we liked so thank you shy guy send me this email this to me please here's one from ribbit and uh toad plus tinky winky and shitty bender equals kakashi <laughs> I guess so. From Kronos, Kronos Neng, Curb Pasa Neng. From Funk Frog, K Pasa Mikneng. From Lemon Line, K Pasa Denk. I I didn't know this would happen. From Poe Ribbon. Here's a cool piece. Kind of um, a little, cy little cyberpunk. It's pretty cool. Here's one from Joey1204. I think it's Joel, Rev, and myself. Here's one from Lizarus. Uh, Numpty plus Cutter. Oh, <laughs> it's for Kirby. Yep, it's pizza cutter. That's cool. From Where Whiskey, Que Pasa Ving. Uh huh. From Bengo Bongo fourteen, Que Capa Neng. Okay. From Lenny. Stream starting soon. Vin struggling with chords. I do frequently struggle with chords. This is this is true facts. From uh, Darquaza. Tiny anime girl pilot. Um, emergency only IQ reserves. Non-meme storage. High capacity meme storage. Food to brain juice processor. Duck switch. Bengulo's anatomy. That's good. Bengulo. That's me. Yep. From Count Deku. <laughs> Kepasa Greng. Bruce Greng? No. No, 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 no. No. From Script C, K a story, Neng. From Long Island Exile. This is really, really great art. And it is Save Pig. <laughs> God. From Lemon Line. Mario, for the last time, I don't have Terminal 7. And it's the Luigi I opened with. From Shark Bits. Here's uh, Vine... Uh, well, Zelda randomized with Tingle as Link. It's quite beautiful. Like I said, Buru is just Tingles and Neng. From Titty Fat. Okay, that's not true, because here's a spider shroom. Juicy spider noises. Well, the spider in and of itself is just very juicy. And if you crack it open and eat the juice, you gain strength. IQ juice, they call it. From GB, here's um, Serana <laughs> floating, just, just maintaining orbit. From Todo Keta, here's pa Paula Neng, Paul Blart, yeah. From Pajama Pants Jack, Que Pasa Diog. No. It doesn't work. You can't just make it work. From Plenty of Poi, there's Pant Panty Chan, No Bully, Robo Anime, whatever. And from Robot Fanaticism, Que Pasa Kling. It works a little bit better, but still. 
All right, have we gotten this out of our system yet? A uh, little bit more. Here's one from Binor. Binyot and Binor. You have a good name, by the way. You have best the car, but now I shall adventure with you, friend. Where to? I think it says car, but I don't know. From Steampunk King, and here's Serana floating around in orbit, melting her brain as much as my brain has currently been melted. I hate everything. All right. Well, that's the stream. Thanks for watching. This has been an interesting art corner. Um, Desert P has been removed as a moderator. Sorry, Desert. Listen, I, I gotta blame you. I got someone's gotta be blamed for the Neng. The Neng Pocalypse. All right. All right. All right. All right. It's okay. Desert will be fine. He'll be fine. He's a, uh, <laughs> this is his fault. Def definitely his fault. Okay. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to go. I'll see you guys later. And, um, I'm going to uh, stream tomorrow for your usual Sunday stream. Again, I don't know what will be on stream tomorrow. Maybe I'll do something a little bit more long form because I did a bunch of compilations last time. I'm, I'm not sure. But, uh, you know, come by if you want. And if you make Neng art, don't. That's fine. And, uh, yeah. I'll catch you all later. Thanks again. And uh, eat pant and and uh, and stop, stop it, St stop it. Get some help. Check out the other Vine Sauce streamers, twitch.tv slash team slash Vine Sauce for all the other streamers or vinesauce.com or Vine Sauce Alert bit.ly slash Vine Sauce Alert. Or you can always go to at Vine Sauce on, uh, on Twitter. So go do that, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye. Good night. Stop it.